UFC Fight Night 105, Brown vs. Lewis brings the heavyweights into the spotlight as former champion Junior Dos Santos and Stefan Struve were due to headline the card. The Struve needed surgery on his shoulder, so he had to pull out. Dos Santos was taken off the card as well, and now Travis Brown and Derek Lewis will fill in. Brown is married to Ronda Rousey, so there will be some intrigue to see how he performs on this card. In the co-main event, former welterweight champion Johnny Hendricks makes his middleweight debut against Hector Lombard. The USC Fight Night 105 Brown vs. Lewis is going up Sunday, February 19, 2017 at the Scotiabank Center in Halifax, Nova Scotia, Canada. And you can watch the preliminaries on UFC Fight Pass on the main card on Fox Sports 1. For the heavyweight bound, Travis Brown vs. Derek Lewis. Brown, who's 18, 5 1, has lost four of his last six after getting outpointed by former champion Fabrizio Verdo in September. He also lost to another former champion, Cain Velasquez, in September. Lewis has won five straight, but he did not impress in a split decision over Roy Nelson in July, and he was losing to Shamil Abdurakimov in December until he scored a knockout win. Lewis is more talented, but Brown might be tougher to knock out, and this will be interesting. Our pick for this fight is Brown. For the middleweight bout, Johnny Hendricks vs. Hector Lombard. Hendricks, who's 17 6, has lost three straight after losing a unanimous decision against Neil Magny in December, and he has had troubles with the weight cut to 170 pounds, so he moved up. Lombard, who's 34, 6, 1, and 2 no contest, had the same issues, so he returned to middleweight and lost via knockout to Dan Henderson. Both men struggled with cardio, so this probably will not last long. Will Hendricks engage Lombard, a Muay Thai artist, or try to use his wrestling? Our pick for this fight is Lombard. For the middleweight bound, Elias Fiatheru vs. Cesar Ferreira. Fiatheru, who's 12-1, bounced back from his pro loss to beat Sam Alvey by unanimous decision in February. While Ferreira, who's 11-5, has won three straight and submitted Jack Hermanson in November. Ferreira is well-rounded, but he is a third-degree black belt in Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, and Fiatheru has to avoid getting taken down, which is easier said than done. Our big for this fight is Ferreira. For another middleweight bound, Diego Santos vs. Jack Marshman. Santos, who's 13-5, is looking to hold a two-game skid after getting submitted by Eric Spicely in September, while Marshman, who's 21-5, has won seven straight, including a TKO over Magnus Sedenblad in his UFC debut in November. Santos is a Muay Thai fighter, while Marshman has 13 knockouts, but both can handle themselves on the mat. This could be the best match of the night. Our pick for this fight is Marshman. For the World Weight Bound, Santiago Poncinibio vs. Nordin Taleb. Puncinibio, who's 23-4, beat Zach Cummings by unanimous decision in August for his third consecutive win. And Taleb, who's 12-3, knocked out Eric Silva in March, but battled injuries for the rest of 2016. Taleb is a great striker, and Puncinibio is very aggressive, which could leave him open for a TKO KO. Our pick for this fight is Taleb.